Okay, so here they are. The uh, old plug, the female, that was burned pretty badly. And this one got burned a little bit when I swapped. This was when I put the new microwave in there. It was heating up too when I swapped it to that plug because I didn't want to use that one. I just figured it wasn't going to conduct well after being heated up and perhaps having some burn on it. This one, I, this is the groundlet that was in there for 20 some other, well, it might, might have been another one in there, but it's been in here for at least 10 years. I've been using this setup for 20, 25 years without any problems unless uh, something went wrong with the microwave or something, you know. But uh, um, anyway, I had cleaned it so that I could, you know, get connection, get a good connection, and I had used it in here with the new microwave. Uh, but what I hadn't done is take it off of here. I had no intention there was anything wrong with the power strip because it didn't, you know, didn't the breaker didn't go off on it or anything. But inside of there, that's what it was like. Once once I had trouble, you know, the new microwave was sounding funny, and actually it still sounds funny. But but it, I did smell, um, you know, burning wire smell when we first turned it on in the room. So uh, we turned it right off and kind of hard to get a good shot of that no matter which way you turn it but this is the uh, old end that I cut off and uh, here's a, the new plug the new plug has a you know it's a ground it's a ground grounded plug but it doesn't uh, this house is not wired with ground so couldn't ground it without running whole new wires and the only thing that ground actually does is uh, protect you from like if a wire was to touch the case you know I mean, a bare wire, like say, it got hot and melted, or wasn't installed properly, and there was strands of it sticking out, touching the case somehow, the metal part, and then you touched it, and you get shot. And then you can do with the operation of the device of the appliances. But anyway, um, that obviously is causing serious resistance and and, and causing this heat. So. Um, now I'm wondering if, I'll go back in yonder, <clears throat> the new microwave might have been actually unnecessary. I'm going to find out here after a while when the sun, it's dark and early in the morning when the sun comes up, I'm going to uh, go out there and test that thing on my 20 amp circuit out in the garage. <clears throat> and uh, this one's, new one is already in and the only thing about it <coughs> is it's uh, kind of loud. So gotta put those down sorry so um, and it sounds almost like sometimes you think it sounds like a fan's hitting something you know so it's kind of worried about it now so I'm gonna I'll just start another video uh, on it uh, but that's where I'm at right now